How about you, Erica? <laughs> don't don't put pressure. On. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. So, Julie told us that you like black licorice. Is that true? Yeah. So I there's do. a lot of different kinds of black licorice <laughs> for you. Oh, oh my God, that is nice. <laughs> <laughs> I I meant I, I'm glad it is. I'm glad. I meant to say for some people think the important thing at a, at a birthday party is presents. I was going to say. I have no use for presents. I have any place to put my hats or this. No presents, please. Well, that's edible, so it'll disappear. Well, I can only say that I'm glad you gave him the black licorice just before we're leaving, because as much as I love Dad, I can't stand the smell of black licorice. I don't want to be anywhere near him when he eats it. Okay. <laughs> well, I remember once um, you came home with a big bag of licorice, and you opened up, and it was chocolate licorice, and me and Mom, and and now we're like, oh, great, chocolate licorice. She's like, oh, I want the black licorice. I'm taking this back. I was supposed to get black licorice. That's how I remember you liked licorice. And I remember Julie when she, she was about 16. And uh, I, I, was always, I was always concerned about seeing men with young women, older men with young women, and, and know uh -huh. that. <laughs> <laughs> it was in their, their wives, and we would uh, we went to have uh, I went to have dinner with her, and uh, I, I think it was just I think he was just old enough to drink at that time. I say twelve. I think the age at the time was eighteen, <laughs> and uh, I you know we were saying here, and I was very uncomfortable. Here I am with this young girl. And I said to the waiters, uh, get, me, get me a beer and see what my daughter will have. <laughs> <laughs> because I wanted to make sure nobody thought it was, it was my girlfriend. <laughs> That's what Jake says. <laughs> you know, I remember when you, uh, I used to go with you when you were buying used cars. Unbelievable. I mean, you would just... The, you would never just buy the car. I remember you would always walk away. You and the salesman are going back and forth. The salesman was saying how great the car was. You were saying how horrible it was, but you were willing to buy it. You'd go back and forth, and then you would always leave and say, no, we're done. We're not going to do it anymore. And then you would just take off with the salesman running after you saying, no, come back. I mean, those battles were unbelievable. So you could never, ever buy anything without bargaining. Yeah, but you do the same thing. Yeah, now I do the same thing. Because <laughs> yeah, I saw you do it. Yeah, so do I. <laughs> and here's a gift from all of us. Basically, they throw us out of the except for the jets. I know, I think I'm. Because you have to look. Well, open the card first. <laughs> <laughs> the card is blue, right, right there. See the card? Oh, it's a card. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. I didn't read who was from. It was from Ben and Jess. Thank you, Ben. And Jeff. Thank you. She picked out the card. <laughs> Hope your 90th birthday is a special event because you're such a special person. That's nice. Have a wonderful day. With love. <laughs> Somebody who has poor Ben. That's fine. That would be bad. <laughs> Everybody signed it. That's oh, everybody signed yeah. it. Oh, okay. <laughs> so you don't even know here, Liza. Yeah. I did. There's a little gift in there for you, Liza. Oh, in the bag, there's a little gift. There's actually two. One's very little. Yeah, one's very little. All right, open the bigger one. Is some deep? <laughs> well, you got to put it in your mouth, but I don't know if you're going to eat it. Oh my gosh. It's <laughs> Bob's idea. Can you play something for us? No. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll tell you, I will when I learn how to play it. Well, you I haven't still? used this thing for 50. I had one. Uh, it was a dramatic. 16 notes. It was a, and it's, you can do, uh, 
Did he get? I don't know if you can understand it. They get uh, shops and flats on it, and uh, it was given to me. It was in a hospital after I, after I, uh, and, well, after the war was over. I suddenly wound up with post-traumatic stress, which I've had for well, I say all my all my life. After after and it happened after the war. And I went to a doctor and I asked him, I said, at that time, what is this? He says, well, he says, evidently it's post-traumatic stress. I said, what the, what exactly is it? He said, well, it's similar similar to what they had after World War World War One. He said, and now they call it post-traumatic stress. So I had a new label and. Uh, but it got so bad that they asked me to go to the hospital. Went to the hospital, spent about a month, and uh, I got the friend, I got friendly with some of the girls. I have a knack of getting to people, and I got friendly with some some of the people there. And they, they said, "Hey, we got something that was given to us by the U.S. Uh, the USO. He said, "It's never been used." He said. Do you play the harmonica? I said, yeah. So they gave me the, it's called the chromatic. And uh, oh, I loved it and I played it oh, for a long, long time. Because I had one before. Uh, your mother and I played at the, uh, the old age home uh, a number of times. And she played the piano and I played the harmonica. I never could read notes. I can only play through memory, and I don't know. Probably it wasn't too good, but the old people like that they know the difference anyway. <laughs> <laughs> but you'll know the difference. And, and uh, what had happened to it? I had it all these years, but some of the notes would grow, and I and we, one one fellow took it to a to a store. The, and they told him it would be better to buy a new one, it would cost you less. So he gave it back to me. I left it in my room and somebody stole it. The thing was about 60 years old. It was a, an heirloom, actually, by this time. So this reminds me of it, that's great. Thank you very much. Where, where, did you, where did you find it, Joe? Bob got it. Oh, Bob got it. How do you open this, honey? Where'd you, go, where'd you get it, Bob? We got it online. Oh, there's also a, a, a real tiny one. <laughs> it came with it. <laughs> So now you have something else to do yeah, other than being on a computer all the time, right? Well, you can play that. So the next time we come down, we expect to hear you play. <laughs> if, if any of you know know anything about music, and I don't, but you can play, you can play certain uh, most songs, but if they were intricate, uh, an ordinary monitor, without a chromatic monitor, you can't, you can't do anything. Okay. Thank you. So You're welcome. I remember one story that